Senator Mark Warner spent his Wednesday making stops throughout our part of Virginia. While the senator spent time talking about the bills he's pushing in Congress, he also had harsh words for President Trump. 10 News reporter Taj Simmons tells us about his trip. Senator Mark Warner could not hide his frustration about last month's government shutdown during his stop in Salem. Just plain crazy. It was a self-inflicted harm. Warner visited Feeding America Southwest Virginia before he gave his food for thought on the shutdown. He told Feeding America about his bill to give tax breaks for grocers who move into food deserts where people do not have easy access to healthy food. The national emergency is the fact that we got a million Virginians that live in food deserts and 40 million Americans that live in food deserts. Warner then took aim at President Trump's national emergency declaration to build a border wall with money from the government. The optics of the president declaring a national emergency, saying he's going to take money, uh, I think inappropriately from either defense funded projects or others, and then climbing on an airplane to go play golf, I think the picture says a thousand words. He says that money would be better spent feeding people in need. And Feeding America says the government shutdown showed why. There are people that live, as he said, paycheck to paycheck. And we see them all the time. A lot of people work, but they still can't make food happen. Warner's bill will be discussed in Congress next month, but the senator hopes to keep the discussion going before then. The number of people that think of themselves as solidly middle class, and they go without that paycheck or two, they are going to be at your doorstep. In Salem, Taj Simmons, 10 News, working for you. Senator Mark Warner will continue his three-day tour throughout our neck of the woods. Tomorrow in downtown Danville, he will walk with city leaders visiting local businesses and talking about ways to boost the economy. He will then travel to Lynchburg touring the Academy Center of the Arts.